will be time for the federal government to do its part. If we don't invest in the infrastructure of cities, if we don't support our neighborhoods uh, when people are struggling, uh, the whole city won't succeed. And I, I think uh, last year we laid the groundwork. This year we'll take real steps towards both those goals. Do you think it's fair, though, on the one hand you have the feds reducing taxes, on the other hand there are a lot of these other fees that the city is introducing in order to cope with a well, that's what always happens. You know, the, the federal government cuts, things trickle down, and, and they end up in the laps of cities. People get that. People want investments in infrastructure. They want us to fight climate change. They want great parks. They want poor neighbors to have a chance. Um, and that's, that, that's uh, the, the challenge of cities across Canada, not just in Toronto. Right, but you, I mean, last year you had the ones that now, you have the cities now campaign. Is there going to be a new campaign this year in order to convince the Fed? Cities across Canada are united on these issues, um, and we'll, we'll keep fighting. And there might well be a federal election this year. I'm sure the funding of cities will be a strong issue. Um, and it's a simple thing. You know, do we want to build public transit in Toronto? Uh, do we want to make sure that our waterfront uh, is a waterfront that's the envy of the world? Do we want to make sure that in our poor neighborhoods in Toronto, every young person has a chance? That's what these issues are about. Torontonians have one answer to that. The answer is yes. Um, and I know they'll keep pressing uh, the federal government along with mayors from across Canada. It's also potentially an expensive year, though, for Toronto. New taxes coming in, uh, new levies coming in, and uh, also a number of contracts of the city are up for negotiation. Well, I think in 2007 was the year Toronto really turned the corner after amalgamation. 2008 is going to be the year that we start building the city. Uh, you know, our transit city plan uh, has funding. We're moving ahead. Uh, we're moving ahead to fight climate change. We're moving ahead to invest in neighborhoods in Toronto that need investment, uh, sometimes in partnership with nonprofit organizations in the private sector. Uh, that's what Torontonians expect, and that's what will happen this year. Yes, uh, there's the new taxes. Um, on the other hand, I think people understand that the city needs uh, proper resources to be able to invest in that kind of infrastructure, and we're going to make those investments. Um, that's what